I could try like a cog the game. <clears throat> okay, let's fight a Cogba. Well, well, well. I thought I was going to do protectors, but that's not it. Um, I think... Let's sell the Ziggs. And we'll go two Vanguards. Two Vanguard, two Brawlers. And let's go red buff with... Oh no, please pull the easy. Let's go for that, it doesn't matter. So we got double buff cog. We're gonna win. The, the cogma did a lot of damage. So we're good. Yeah, I'm trying to think of like what 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 our final build is gonna be. So depending on that, the items will change as well. But I've got a good feeling about this battle cast game. Well, turning this comp into battle cast, I think that's what we might do. All right, two star poppy. So the classic build of of static shift stacking on Kogma. I'm not doing that one. Not for this game. Blue buff is actually really good on him because Kogma does instant ult. Yeah, this is like uh, perma ult Cog because he only has 30 mana cost. So he's always going to have like infinite attack range. And you know what? We're going to make money. I'm going to sell the Blitz. Let's go Giant's Belt. There we go. Two star Cog. Let's do that, and so yeah, let's go battle cast bonus for level 5. Okay. I'm sort of tempted to go into the war mugs, but I'm going to hold off. It might be a trap claw, but you can see our cog activating his ult right off the bat with the blue buff, and he's actually doing a ton of damage. So blue buff cog, or this is called the double buff cog. Is totally viable. Look at that, six five thousand four hundred damage. I don't know about Rage Blade right now. I'm thinking about it. Okay, we got a bow. That's pretty good. And I like Runons because he's actually gonna hit two guys at once. I think Runons is the move. It's not Gwinsu. Mm hmm. I agree. Okay, let's go Runons. So Kogma will hit. Two champions at once. Basically, we got one of the most ideal builds if I want to do this uh, kind of Kogma carry, and we're going to try Kogma carry this game. So, everything looking all good. Tons of damage. Again, another 5,500 damage. Alright, let's go level 6. We got Cassiopeia, another EZ. So, go with two brawlers. Oh, snap. He got the Zephyr. I think my team's still better. Yeah. Nice. Alright, let's go two star easy. Two star Malphite. Um, yeah, you know what? I'm gonna put Malphite now. And man, we're not getting any Lowies, which is sort of unfortunate. We're gonna try to transition into four Battle Cast soon, or four four Brawlers. That would be good too. And we win, easy. Yeah, let's grab a spatula. So that's going to give us a uh, battle cast item. So we have four brawlers now, which is great. Let's put that in. And the Wormogs. I'm going to give it to Blitz. I'm going to actually sell them. Because I don't want the spatula on them. We still need our Allowies. We still need the Allowies. Nothing good. 
There we go. That's good. Which remove champion do I miss the most? Um, you know, it's actually Dark Star Lux. Yeah, she wasn't very good, but at the same time, I just kind of miss her. I was gonna say Kale, but I hate playing against Kale, so it's gonna be a no. All right, Lowy, let's. Fizz, Jinx, that's good. Let's crank. Hmm. I got Fizz as well. I got Victor. So I actually want to go full battle cast. Wait, do I want to go Nocturne though? Oh, that's a lot of Fizz. Alright, four battle cast. I'm trying to put the Nocturne into Fizz. And in terms of items, it's either a Battle Cast Blading or Rebel Metal. And the reason why I would say this is also good is because I could put in the Jinx, go three Rebels, but. Mm, you know what? I think it's the Battle Cast Blading. Jinx. Winnie Cogmas. So battle cast item. Hmm. Maybe I don't use Jinx this game. I just keep the easy, don't use the Jinx. No Cogmas. But I can't, kind of can't put the Fizz in right now. Uh, fizz Battle Cast? Hmm. I could do Fizz Battle Cast. Like, I need to keep my front line. That's why I'm not putting the Fizz. I need to, I, like, if my front line crumbles, then, then Kogma dies. So, like, we're still winning, though. We're still winning. It's a, it's a 13 win streak. Okay, let's get the victor. Thank you. Two star victor. You know what I might do? Uh, I want to keep the victor on the board. Alright, we're going to lose this round. Oh, maybe not. Dude, that Kogma healing is actually insane. Like the battle cast healing. Wow. The battle cast healing is pretty insane. I'm gonna buy all the fizz. Maybe I shouldn't have gone for 3 star Kogma, because I would be at level 8 right now. Level 8 or. Basically, almost a level 8 with a lot of gold. But, man, this Kogma is carrying really hard. And he, he's going to. He's going to have to carry this game really hard, so. Alright. Yalawi. You know what? I'm going to ignore that. Oh my god, look at this. Alright, I got to go level 7. I just can't sell anyone. Alright, let's do this. Battle cast Fizz, so we got 6 battle casts, 480 healing. And... Would I give Nocturne any items? I still have a Megatron on him. Maybe it's Guardian Angel Fizz. Yeah, I'm gonna go Guardian Angel Fizz. Because he's going to be 3 stars. And I'm going to go Quicksilver Sash. He's 
just need one more Nocturne as well. Battle cast Fizz. Let's go. Alright, we win. Against Rebels. I can bring back the Brawler. You know what? I could put in Blitzcrank instead. I don't really like Nor. I don't really care about him. Oh. I thought I was going to lose here. Nice job, Kogma. Frozen Heart or Jeweled Gauntlet? I'm a, You know the Frozen Heart's really good, but I'm going to go with Jeweled Gauntlet. Yeah, so we want to go big damage fizz. He gets some crit, and he his spell will do crit as well. So big sharky. We want to do a one shot shark. Yeah, big damage. So we lose. Okay, that's okay. I really want to go level eight, but I think I have to roll if I want to three start a cog. Blitz. There we go, we got 3 star uh, Nocturne, so this is why I stay at level, level 8, because level 7. We wanted a better chance to get 3 star Kogma and Nocturne. Alright, nice. So here we go. 3 star Fizz, we got 3 star Nocturne last turn. And um, our boy Fizz is going to do 5600 damage. And he's also going to do healing or extra damage from battle cast bonus. So 5,600 chum the waters. How cool is that? That's really cool. Oh, triple blitz. I should still, you know what? We're one Kogma away. You know what? I'm sure Kogma will show up even if we're level eight. I really want to put in the brawler front line. Let's give this to, uh, yeah, three star Nocturne. So here we go. Six battle cast infiltrators. It's gonna be a one shot. Oof. Twenty thousand fizz damage. That's gotta be a world record. Twenty thousand fizz damage. All right, three star J, three star Nico, two star Jana. This guy has a really good team for Star Guardians, but I think the fizz one sharky. Oh, he's not, he's not using his ult, that's why... Yeah, he didn't use his ult uh, fast enough, so we lost this round. So he has a 3-star Teemo. Oh, snap. Alright, okay, I'm gonna put Fizz a little bit more here. 3-star Teemo. I think this, yeah, my Sharky and the Nocturne can get it. Come on, focus the, focus the Teemo. Yeah, Teemo died. 16,000 Fizz. And we win. Hey, I'm not the only one with the strongest team. The other two guys also got their own 3 stars. 3 star Star Guardians. So Chalice boosted Fizz. That's 6,800 damage. The only problem is he's not getting Shark fast enough. 3 star Syndra, like... He died before... Yeah, like... The Shark comes out at the end. Because he, he just gets crowd controlled too much um let's go level nine i think uh mystic yeah i really need mystic too bad we didn't get the cog all right i'm gonna put fizz like here actually let's try this positioning I just put him in the corner this time. He gets stunned like all the time. Come on, use your ult, bro. The Fizz never gets the shark off. Maybe we need Urgot. 
man. I might have to actually take. I don't want to take off the cog. I really don't. Alright, we're gonna do this. Twenty five thousand damage short. We're gonna lose. But hey, it was worth a shot. The three star star guardians, Syndra, Nico, Jarvan, and, and, and the two star Janna. A little bit too strong, but hey. 